What I like to do with buying a pair of sunglasses for fishing is, uh, you know, ultimately start out with uh, something I like. You know, it catches my eye. Uh, the most important thing is the, the frame, the style, you know, what's comfortable to you. You know, I personally like something really light. You know, I like these thick sides. So when I put these glasses on, it eliminates a lot of the light coming in, which allows me to focus out front and, and be able to look down into the water and see some things that normally you wouldn't see if you had a little bit of sunlight intrusion on the side. So, you know, I like the mirrored lens when we're out there in the full, full bright sun. It eliminates a lot of the glare. You know, you might walk in and look at this thing and, and, and just be overwhelmed and confused that there's so many glasses. And you know, where do you start? The best thing to do is start picking something you like that, that looks attractive to you, and then just start trying them on and get that frame that's comfortable. And then from there you can change. You can go, uh, I like glass. You know, plastic is great too. The plastics they have nowadays are very clear, a lot lighter. This is the amber. You have the sunrise, which is really good in low light. Um, you know, early mornings, late afternoon, if you're out there stalking, you know, on the flats, it's, it's a great lens here. The other thing they have is a, a green mirrored, which I really like. I mean, obviously the blue mirror is really good for being offshore in that high, high sunlight. Um, it, it really cuts down on the glare and lets these guys see down in the water. They even have a silvered mirror, which is really cool. Again, what you need to do is you need to find a frame that's comfortable for you, and then from there you move forward and try different lenses and see what you like. You know, me personally, so I do an amber mirror, and what that does is that allows me to find the bait in the shallow water and cut through little shortcuts and go through channels. And then it also, with that mirror being on there, it actually cuts down a lot of the glare, so it works really well offshore uh, for me.